Hey, you! <laughs> hey, Beatrice, what's wrong? Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Secondly, Mr. Hatrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, yeah, there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is going to know about. We're like doomed lovers. Enough. Okay, I'll get your book back. Then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over.
Yes, I did. And I didn't read it. Much. Much obliged. That was exactly as I'd expected. No sweat. Jimmy, I need to get back to the girls' dorm. Will you please walk me home? Yeah, all right, let's do it. Everyone is getting on the jocks this year. I feel trapped here. I've lost. Why would Mr. Hattrick call me at work? Why would Mr. Hattrick call me at work? I swear she got a nose job. And she's like only 12. It's totally not cool. Oh my god, did you see Mandy making herself sick in the toilets again? Miss Phillips hits on male students. Come over here and take 